Welcome to Trimble Business Center Aerial Photogrammetry What's New in 5.19. In this video we want to take a closer look at the enhancements done for the DSM processing. So another thing that also will come with 5.90 is um, improvement in the edges of the digital surface model so therefore this will be smoother and also also sharper lesser of here some uh, fizzles at, at, at the edges um, therefore with the new 5.90 the engine will be improved uh, for the edge extraction of digital surface model Additionally, also on the digital surface model, it's possible to eliminate moving objects. So, uh, therefore, um, we can then look for objects that are not in all images at the same position and therefore then try to eliminate them and to create, in this case, a cleaner, uh, more empty looking. Um, true autophoto when using in this case here uh, Trimble Business Center version 5.90. And finally also there is the goal in this uh, true auto generation to eliminate hot spots. So in our case for example when we take a look here at this car um, then we see here it tries here to eliminate the year these hotspots and also when we take a look for example um, here on on this car here then it tries also to use the more um, radiometric um, um, better distributed uh, part for the extraction and we can also see it here for example in this car where this tries to remove or to take um, in the true auto generation areas with lesser hotspots. And uh, finally, also um, a last thing is the boundary. So in version 5.81, uh, the boundary was calculated using the projection centers of our most out far located images and um, now with version 590 the um, uh, boundary is now automatically calculated um, during the point cloud generation and will be extended to the um, outer part of the last stereo model extends so of course you need to have one stereo model to be able to mesh uh, to match uh, points and therefore this green line here represents depending of course how the height differences are in the terrain um, where the last stereo model can look at the representative of the terrain and this is then our new uh, boundary extent when you do not select a boundary. When you select a boundary then of course the boundary will be our limitation so you can still um, digitize your boundary and create a smaller area uh, for your point cloud uh, which will then be used for any type of processing of any elevation type. Please be aware that the outer line uh, we have still to decide if this will be even shown in 590 but if it's shown this has nothing to do with this automatic calculation of the boundary this is here just um, a blowout representation uh, from uh, the given data so therefore this uh, point cloud in this case here is automatically internally calculated and should be very similar to the US master result. So if you would run in US master the point cloud 
you would get a very similar boundary. So this sums up all the new features that you will get now with Trimble Business Center Arrow Photogrammetry in 590. And um, to finally also address the last open part is what if the images, the drone images are not geotagged and you have a separate external file with your exterior orientation. And here the answer is that you will need to go still through US Master because US Master has here a very extensive import wizard allowing you to uh, attach the according orientations to the correct images. There are a couple of things to be here addressed. Normally the geotech orientations means you need to know also is this here um, in the correct coordinate system and also is this in degree or is this in gone the angles and there are a couple things to be uh, addressed also for the orientations for this part if you want to attach them correctly. Um, of course if you have only GNSS you can also import them into US Master. Uh, the IDs have to fit to each other and therefore US Master offers you here a very nice and good wizard to get your separate file attached to your not geotagged drone images. So we hope this helps you to um, run now Trimble Business Center 590 with all its new capabilities able to run any frame-based third-party drone in TBC which is um, using a um, mapping project type. So images looking mainly straight down uh, like Nadia images in this case. This would be uh, now possible with Trimble Business Center Aero Photogrammetry 5.9. So thank you for watching this video and see you in the next one. Goodbye.